During a discussion about existentialism, a professor explains to us that all true intellectuals must understand that meaning is always subjective. It is simply a matter of who wins the majority of vote. For example, this is only a hand because enough mouths spoke it into existence. So a while back, I decided I tried to be my own self-determining agent of authenticity. So this is not a hand. Nah. See, this is a hoobaloo. I occasionally pick shit up with it. Here, pass me the ball. Watch me catch it with my hoobaloos. This is meaning for me. It is mine. I made it. I am not asking you for yours yet. What does it matter without the majority's approval? For the last few years, I've been attempting to define my own meaning for joy. The dictionary says that joy is a state of happiness or felicity, yet that always felt so limiting. If joy truly only shows up when I am happy, then it does not deserve me. No, I want my definition of joy to be bigger than that. The day I was diagnosed HIV positive, I showered my body in this world's definition of sorrow. I was supposed to be sad. Every mouth around me spoke it into existence. Tim, you're only 21. Tim, you've only loved once. Tim, you must truly hate him. But see, today, today I am 29, y'all. Just as alive as before, only difference is now a college graduate with enough intellect to understand that meaning Meaning is always subjective, so I'll tell you what joy is. Joy is a year and a half later after my diagnosis. It is me calling my ex, calling my first love and telling him that I forgive him for everything. Joy is me unblocking his phone number, me listening to the year he has had the struggles he has been forced to go through. Joy is me no longer being afraid to admit that I still, that I still, that I still love the man that gave me a terminal illness. And though the majority of you may not approve of this, well that, that is okay. Because this, this right here is joy for me. It is mine. I made it. I made it, I made it, and I am not asking you for your, thank y'all so very much for having me, I really appreciate it.